Let's see this question. So both sides are raised by 1,000. So the left-hand side, the base, is 2a minus 3. The right-hand side is 8. But both sides being raised by 1,000. So what we could do is we just take the index, right? So we take the index 1,000th root. So basically, we take 1,000th root on both sides. In this case, the left hand side will get 2a minus 3, 1,000 divided by 1,000, right? The power is in the numerator of the rational exponent. And the index is in the denominator of the rational exponent. And the same thing for the left-hand side. But because 1,000 is an even number, so when we do that, we've got a plus minus two values, a positive value and a negative value. So same thing with A raised by 1,000 divided by 1,000. Well, 1,000 divided by 1,000 is just one. So we get 2A minus three equals to plus minus eight. So two cases. So the first case is 2a minus three equals to positive eight. So solve for a, subtract a on both sides. So 2a minus a equals to three. So basically remove a to the other side becomes negative. Remove negative three to the other side becomes positive. 2a minus a is just eight. So a equals three. So first solution. Second, 2a minus 3 equals to negative 8. Yeah. Then we add a on both sides. Or oh, we move negative 8 to this side, move negative 3 to the other side. So we get a 2a plus a equals to 3. That is 3a equals to 3 divided by 3 on both sides. So a equals 1. So we have two solutions. a equals 3, a equals 1. Well, let's check. 2 times 3, 6. 6 minus 3, you get a 3. 3 raised by 1,000 on the left-hand side. And on the right-hand side, the 3 raised by 1,000. Yes. Now, A equals 1. 2 times 1, 2. 2 minus 3, negative 1. Negative 1 raised by 1,000 is positive 1. And the right-hand side is just 1 raised by 1,000 is positive 1. So both good. So we have two solutions for this equation.